Um, 22 state attorneys general wrote to the FDA and threatened to enforce state laws that might prevent millions of women from accessing medication that is prescribed by they, their doctor. And the medication their doctor determined is important to their health and well-being. Uh, again, this is not just an attack on women's fundamental freedoms. Um, it is an attack on the very foundation of our public health system. And I might note that most Americans could look in their medicine cabinet where they will find medication prescribed by a doctor that they use on a daily basis and have available to them because the FDA engaged in a process of determining the efficacy and safety of that medication. Mifepristone is no exception to that process. And so those who would attack this process and the ability of the FDA to make these decisions ought to look in their own medicine cabinets to figure out where they're prepared to say that those medications that they need to alleviate suffering and to prolong the quality of life should no longer be available to them. Because that is what we are talking about. 